Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be reviewing, demoing on my lips as well as swatching on my hands all the new MAC Matte Lipsticks. Woo, that was a little bit hard to say. And I believe these are going to stay at the MAC stores. It says on their website that they are here to stay. So in case you guys are wondering if they're going to be just a limited edition, I believe they're actually going to be in these stores. So if they sell out, don't worry about it. You're going to get your hands on them. Just to let you guys know, I have already tried these on. They are actually not drying at all from the few seconds that I had them on because I did do the swatches already. But they weren't drying at all. They were actually... I have one on my lips. I actually have styled in sepia on my lips right now and it isn't drying at all. I've been wearing it for quite some time already and I really really like the application. I like that it's not too drying. So although these lipsticks are matte, they are not too too drying. So if you are wondering if you're going to like them or not, maybe you are just because I actually really like them and they're not drying at all. The way I got my hands on these lipsticks before they launched on their store is that they launched on their website so I was able to get them there but they are launched October 9th in the stores if you do want to buy them so I'm trying to get this video up very quickly for you guys in case you guys are still hesitating or wondering if you want these lipsticks now I'm gonna move on with the swatches the first one that we have is the color styled in sepia this one I noticed it looks a lot like that lip liner that a lot of people are liking the color stone from Mac I really 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 like this I actually have it on my lips and it's something that I'm definitely gonna be wearing for the fall it reminds me of a very dark nude but not brown and this is something that I'm really going to be using a lot for the fall. So if you guys are into, into those types of colors, this is definitely one to get. The next one is called Pander Me and this is a really pretty pink. It's almost an orange, an orangey tone based lip but it's really really beautiful I actually really really like it it's something that again I really 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 am so glad that I bought so that's the next one next one is Navul Vogue I'm not sure if I'm pronoun if I'm pronouncing that but this one is the next one so this one's actually really really pretty I loved how it looks on my lips Next is Damn Glamorous. I really, really, really like this one. It's actually a really bright red. It's almost very orangey. This made my teeth look super, super white. So it's something that I'm definitely going to be wearing when I want a red lip. Next one is La Veille en Rouge. I'm not sure if I'm saying that correctly. If you are looking for more of a red, don't get this one, but get Damn Glamorous. Just in case you're wondering or you want a new red lipstick to add to your collection. Next is Fashion Revival. This one's a really, really, really pretty. It's like a, a pink red. It's really pretty. It has purple undertones, which I really, really liked. And it kind of reminded me of Rebel in a way. But it's really, really pretty. I, I really, really liked it. Next is Living Legend. This one, although it looks pretty dark, once I applied it on my lips, it actually almost looked black. So if you aren't into the very, very dark lip and you're scared that it's going to be too dark, this is definitely not for you. When I applied it on my lips, I was like, holy moly, it's way darker than I expected. The last one is Heroin by MAC. And this one is a very, very, very purple color. And it's definitely something to wear for the fall or for the summer. I wear it all year round. I look so crazy with all of these swatches. That's it for this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the lip swatches and the arm swatches in case you guys are still interested or curious if you guys are going to buy them. All I got to say about these is that I really, really liked all of the colors. I actually really like the formula, how it's not too drying. And it, I have this one on my lips. It hasn't budged. Nothing has happened. I really, really like it. Let me know which one was your favorite. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy these MAC reviews because I love buying MAC lip products. If you guys have any questions on any of the products or any concerns, make sure to comment. Thank you guys so much for watching.